Hey, hey, Troy, no Hannah, no Hannah, but we have Kyle. So Kyle's come in and he, I've known Kyle for 35 years probably, he used to work for me as a personal trainer. He's gonna cover, he's now a phys physician's assistant and he's gonna cover a boatload of topics over the course of the next few shows. And uh, it's gonna be a great time. At the end of this show, today's show, we're gonna talk about a prize that we're gonna be giving away. And we're gonna talk a couple of different basic topics at the very end. So stay tuned till the very end to make sure you get all of the medical knowledge you could ever imagine and all the things you wanna know about Kyle. So Kyle, bring us forward. Oh, well, Troy, thank you for very much for everything. Um, started with Troy 30 something years ago as a uh, personal trainer out at Mingus Creek. Um, ended up going to physician assistant school over at Western Michigan. And I wanted to start with um, basically an introductory about myself, uh, where I come from and what I'd like to talk about with the different um, times I get to come in as the guest speaker with Troy and Hannah. Um, and I apologize for the notes, but I'm old school. I take notes, refer back to them. Um, things come to me while I'm talking, things come to me when I'm driving, so I write them down. But um, as Troy said, Kyle, um, I'm a Battle Creek native, uh, born and raised in Battle Creek, Michigan. Uh, went to Kellogg Community College, ended up at University of Michigan. Uh, while I was at Michigan, I was in Air Force ROTC. Uh, spent uh, quite a few years in the Air Force. In the early to mid 90s, got caught in a reduction in force. So I say I basically got laid off from the Air Force. Came back uh, home to Battle Creek trying to figure out what I wanted to do. Thought about grad school, but uh, decided to go back to KCC and get some refresher courses. That led to uh, my working with Troy. Um, we had an instructor in common who recommended me to go out and work with Troy. Uh, spent four or five great years with Troy learning how to be a personal trainer, uh, working as a fitness director out at Mingus Creek. And that eventually led to my going to grad school over at Western Michigan in the physician assistant program. And I've been a PA for about over 20 years now. Um, my first experience as a PA or with, at, with a PA was uh, while I was in the Air Force. Uh, the PA career actually started uh, with the um, Army Med uh, Medical Corpsman and, excuse me, the Navy Corpsman and um, the army medics that were coming back from Vietnam and they had all this medical knowledge and somebody was smart enough to say, let's start a physician assistant program and that started in the early 1970s. Now we're trying to get away from the word assistant, we're trying to become more physician associate. Um, and um, another um, video I have, I'll talk about some of the nomenclature and uh, more about PAs, nurse practitioners, different types of docs and things like that. A um, little more about me, um, as a PA, I started in family medicine, uh, working for an osteopath, a DO, which I'll talk about in the nomenclature talk. Um, also worked otolaryngology, which is the big fancy medical term for ear, nose and throat doc. Also worked pulmonology, which is the lung doc. Worked sleep medicine, I was along with uh, the pulmonology. Actually worked at the prison down in Coldwater, Michigan for a year. Very interesting. Um, shortly after that, I got into doing in-home care. So I would provide medical care for patients that were homebound, whether it be in their home, an assisted living facility, or nursing home. Um, and that is uh, what I've been doing for the last eight, nine years. And I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy it. Um, a lot of my classmates after 20 years are looking at retiring, but I'm still having way too much fun and I enjoy the work. Um, last thing about me is I am an amputee, which will be another one of my talks about life as an amputee, but I lost my leg in December of 2019. Um, after being in the hospital for eight weeks, rehab for about eight weeks, I was released. And as I was getting ready to go back to work, COVID hit, which kind of put a damper on my work since uh, the in-home medicine could be done virtually. They didn't need as many live bodies going out to see the patients. So um, my 
abilities were not needed. I finally got back into work uh, part-time uh, December of 2021, uh, but mainly been working just part-time because I'm still uh, having physical therapy as well as doing a lot of training on my own as well as with Troy uh, to continue to improve my strength. And there are some other things that I've been doing that we'll talk about in the amputation, the life as an amputee talk. Um, I always um, appreciate comments. I don't mind uh, learning things. If uh, you, uh, as a, view a viewer, hear something or know something different, throw it in the comments. Put your questions in the comments. Uh, put in uh, suggestions for future topics. Uh, I know I've got quite a few. I'm going to work with Troy and Hannah on other ones. Uh, but um, with my experience in medicine, with my experience in fitness with Troy, most of my talks are going to be health related. Um, a lot of my opinions based on my experience, things I've researched, facts, uh, but I've also learned from inc some incredible, incredible people, including Troy, uh, who's taught me a ton about fitness and health. I've learned from um, both during uh, PA school from some great physicians and other PAs and nurse practitioners, as well as uh, my experience as a PAC, which we'll talk about also. Um, worked with some great docs who've taught me a lot. I've learned a lot from them, learned a lot on my own during research in different conferences and I feel this is a great opportunity to share some of that experience with the viewers um, and with any good video um, leave your comments but also if you like it hit the like button please share it and then also subscribe if you can and we appreciate it thank you well the best news Kyle is now that you have everything you could possibly ever want to know about Kyle and you already know it about me it's time to win surprises. So anybody who subscribes to the channel will be entered into a contest to win an actual infrared sauna that will be given away. So that's gonna be fun. And all you gotta do is be a subscriber and you're gonna be in the mix. We'll draw you out and uh, get that to you ASAP. But um, anything else for us real quick? We got a ton that we're going to be covering. So any yep. last second things? Right now, no. I just want to make this an introductory thing. And thanks again for having me in as a speaker. It, I really appreciate it. Can't wait to can't wait to get into every detailed topic. But just get on the subscription list. Let's have some fun with this. Make sure that you put all of those comments in the comment section so we know what you want us to talk about. We have a whole list. We've got things that we're going to cover that we think are important but you might have something that's very specific that we wouldn't have thought of, and we'd love to cover that as well. Subscribe, like, share, tell all your friends. See you soon. Listen to him. <laughs>